What's going on guys? Uh, today I have a huge announcement and you know I've been very excited about it. I've been uh, you know quiet about it for a while because I uh, wanted to make sure everything uh, went well and went the way it should go but uh, it's about the uh, chocolate bootla and uh, I'm proud to announce that uh, I've teamed up with somebody that I trust to help me further stabilize the chocolate bootla in a rapid manner um, and do it in a scientific and professional way and uh, that would be uh, Ed at Puckerbutt Pepper Company. Um, he's going to uh, help me as, as well as me growing down here and a few other friends that are helping in, in test growing are going to uh, grow it and, and do it in greenhouses and then submit it to the university and have a, a botanist and a chemist uh, working on it to to scientifically do it right uh, so Ed is going to be helping me uh, with that on a larger scale and, and a lot faster so you know doing it at my rate would take a very long time and uh, and I wanted to do it and, and, and make it stable and make it right uh, to get to get it correct to be able to give out to people um, but also uh, you know I told him, I was like, you know, I, I, I'm, I'm totally fine with using skin and flesh and, and stuff like that off of it. And so, um, there will be a special edition uh, reserve chocolate bootla sauce coming out probably late December, right before Christmas. Uh, and it will be called the uh, Brown Plague. Um, I'll try to post up pictures of it. Um, the, uh, I say well, me and Ed have the privilege of having a, a world-class artist working on the uh, artwork. Guy named by Kit Nelson out of the UK. Very talented, very very talented guy. Uh, he is already pretty much 90% done with the uh, labeling of the sauce, and uh, I, I'm I'm very proud of of the artwork and uh, of the uh, things moving forward to try to to get this thing. Um, you know where it needs to be um, and I'm you know honored to have Ed uh, help me on it and uh, goes back me and Ed known each other a while I was one of the first uh, chili guys uh, to, to talk to him um, besides Ted and, and a few other guys and uh, and you know I needed somebody you know that I could really trust that could handle something of this nature and and do it in the right way in the professional way uh, so you know Ed was honored and I was honored and so that's that's it we're hoping we're hoping like two years uh, maybe sooner uh, just all depends on they have some new techniques and new things they're working on at the university and you know uh, next trip up I'm going to uh, meet with the uh, chemist and botanist at the university with Ed and they're gonna show me some of the things they're doing and so I'm very excited you know I'm a pepper nerd so um, I'm you know I'm excited to see what they're doing they're doing some new things with some different new gels they've developed that it was telling me about um, and you know I am excited and I'm excited uh, to tell you guys the news and so you know, it won't be eight years for it to come out. You know, we're talking maybe, maybe a year and a half, two years, uh, just depending on the results and variations in the pods. Um, and there's also a close knit of friends that are growing uh, other phenotypes out, and and those will be tested as well as 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 run through the course too. So, and, you know, I want to give big shout outs to Ed Curry, uh, about Pepper Company. Kit Nelson out the UK. Thank you, brother, for all your hard work you've done. Uh, awesome, some close friends uh, that put uh, timeless uh, time and effort into helping uh, pick out the right phenotypes. Um, you know, Jack Chapman and his family. Um, Chad Selisky, which none of this would be possible without his original red bootla from the very beginning. Uh, Rick State Rick States Stansky, uh, Christopher Phillips, and of course you know Ted Barris for Ted Barris and Todd uh, Warsh T Mutter for originally 
testing this out back in the day. Uh, the two original guys first pop it in her mouth and, and, and really get hit by it. Um, sorry, I'm looking rough, man. I just got off of school and uh, and wanted to get this video out real quick to you guys. And uh, I should have some other videos coming up real soon. But that's the big news um, that I've teamed up. And hopefully I can get this out in a fast manner. And there will be a cool sauce for everybody to try. I'm excited. I think I'm going up next week. And we're going to work on a, a, a recipe. And, uh, and and do some, I'm going to take some more tour. Try to take some more pictures and videos. Uh, try to take uh, some little videos of, of the process. And maybe of some of the stuff going on in the kitchen. Um, and uh, I just uh, I appreciate, uh, appreciate everybody. I, I really, really uh, love being part of the Chilla community. And... And growing all kinds of stuff, man. Just not even super hot. Just different annuums and and uh, potatoes and pubescens. Um, it's just a real joy to to do this. It's, it's to get out in the garden. It's good stress relief and and uh, and to involve even my kids and and, and stuff like that and, and picking and growing and yeah. You know, daughter really doesn't play anything. But she sure can dig some holes and and she likes doing that and and uh, you know I'm just uh. I'm I'm real blessed and and uh, honored to uh, have some great in individuals uh, as friends and and, and and trusted you know colleagues and and and, and the stuff I'm trying to do. So I uh, appreciate you guys' time. I didn't want to take up too much. I hope you have a great day and I'll talk to you later. Bye bye.